if you use WhatsApp for your business, definitely you want more people to chat with you on WhatsApp and eventually become your customer. And one of the ways you can do this, you can send a link to them. And when they click on the link, they go straight to your WhatsApp and continue chatting with you. If you have a group you want these people to join, you can go straight to the group and share the link for them to be able to join via the link. So when you send this kind of link to them, they come to your WhatsApp, they join either your group or they chat with you directly. However, in many situations, you probably want to collect more information that you can use for marketing purposes. For example, you might want to collect their email address, their location, and so on. Now, if you are sending this kind of link to them, you will not be able to collect that kind of information directly on your WhatsApp. And that is why you might want to use WhatsApp form to collect this kind of information and still direct them directly to your WhatsApp and continue chatting with them for your business purpose. And because of this, I want to show you how to create a WhatsApp form that you can use to collect as much as possible information that will be very relevant for your business. So right now on this website, you can create a WhatsApp form that you can use to collect information just like you are building an email list with your opt-in form. So if I go ahead and log into my account on this website, I will be able to build my WhatsApp form. I already have one here. So this one, I have been using it to collect information. And you can see at the moment, I have 35 responses in my account. By the way, I will not be able to see these responses in my dashboard because I am using the free version of this particular platform. So if you are using the free version, you will still be able to get all the responses in your WhatsApp. However, if you want to be able to see all the responses in your dashboard, then you need to upgrade your account on this particular platform. If you want to upgrade, I think the light plan might be okay for you because that is just $12 per month. I don't want to upgrade my account, so I'll go back to my dashboard and I will show you how to build a form that you can use to collect as much as possible information from your prospective customer. So if I go ahead and click on this new WAS form, then it's going to pop up. My phone number is already there because before you can start building the WhatsApp form on this platform, you need to link your WhatsApp to the platform. So I have already linked my WhatsApp to this platform and that is why my phone number is coming up. So if you have not linked, you will need to first of all link your WhatsApp to the platform. So the next thing I want to do now is I'll click on next. So after clicking on next, I have some options here. I can start my form from scratch. I can use template or I can even copy from Google Form. So if you have some beautiful Google Form that you want to use to collect information from your prospect and you want those information to be sent directly to you on WhatsApp, then you can go ahead and copy from Google Form. However, if you don't have, you can go ahead and build from scratch or use the template. So I can go ahead and select the template. Then when I select the template, you can see we have about seven different templates available here. We have travel broken, contact form, food order, event registration, and so on. So if I want to use event registration, for example, I can click on event registration. So immediately I click on event registration, the form comes up. So the basic information needed for this particular event is populated. The full name is there, the email address is there, then what is the next thing? The company name is there, then the position is there. So you can see all of this. So when you finish building this form, then you can just go ahead and get the link. When you get the link, you will see when anybody arrive on this particular page, they will be able to fill this information. And when they fill the information, they submit it directly to you on WhatsApp and you will be able to see them chatting directly with you on WhatsApp. So you already collected their information and that is the beauty of this particular platform. You can build form, beautiful form on this platform and send it to people and they will be able to chat with you on WhatsApp at the same time, when they're chatting with you, you already collect enough information from them. So it is different from you sending your WhatsApp link to them directly to join either your group or chat with you without submitting some relevant information that you could use for your marketing purpose. So if you want to be able to build more of a very customized form that you can use to collect more information, this is the best platform I would recommend for you. Now, if I go back to my dashboard, and I want to start new. This is the template I just used. I can delete it. So after deleting it, I can go ahead and click on create a new form. Then next, then I can start from scratch. Then from the left hand side, we can drag a lot of options here. I can drag maybe the checkbox. Then I can drag the text to the top. If I want to use image, I can drag the image. 
let's say you are building a, a, a WhatsApp form for event registration and you want them to watch introductory video about the event, then you can drag the video there, you can embed the video, then if you want to embed the video, you can see. It's asking me to enter the YouTube link, so I can just go to my YouTube and copy a link here. Let's look at this link, get a shareable link. I can just paste it there. You see, the video is there. I don't even need to have an image here because I already had a video. I can go ahead and remove this. Then I can go to the next. Maybe this is a question. Type your question. Maybe where are you located? Then what's the next? Multiple choice. Maybe male or female. What's the multiple choice? That's a what's your gender? And uh, then I can choose maybe male, female, then enter your email address. Where is, where is email? I can drag email here, email address. So I can add another thing, maybe tell us your job type two. What's your job type two? Job type two. Then, which other thing? I can add as many as possible information here. If I see that it's okay, I can go ahead and publish it. Immediately I publish it, I can open it here. Then you can see, this is the form. So this is a very beautiful form I can send to people, then they can start contacting me on WhatsApp. So if anybody go ahead and fill this form and click on submit on WhatsApp, I will get the detail on WhatsApp. Let's go ahead and test this. Lagos, um, uh, info at Ojaswell.com. Yeah, my mail. Then let's submit it. For this particular form, it's response 001. Then I can go ahead and continue. And it's going to send the details to me on WhatsApp. You can see where are you located? Lagos. Then enter your email. The email is there. What's your gender? Mail. What's your job type? So you can see if you go ahead and continue with the chat, this is the exact detail you are going to send directly to the person on WhatsApp. And that is how you can use this kind of form to collect more relevant information for your business and eventually use it for marketing purpose. So it is much, much better than just sending a WhatsApp link to them to come and chat with you on WhatsApp or to join your WhatsApp group. So this is much better and I believe you definitely want to use it. If you want to go ahead and register on this website, you might want to use my affiliate link. So I'm going to go ahead and drop the affiliate link in the description of this video so if you use my affiliate link to join the website and maybe you decide to upgrade your plan to the paid plan i will be any commission each time you renew your plan on the platform so i believe you learned something in this video if you have any question about it feel free to ask and i will answer your question thanks again for watching and bye for now